Alert Forecast with meteorologist Alex Puckett. Skycams relatively quiet this morning. We've been keeping our eye out for a little bit of patchy fog, but right now Tupelo looking okay. You see the flag waving there on our Alpha Insurance Skycam. That can help when we get the wind blowing in the morning. It typically inhibits fog development. Uh, but having said that, a few spots seeing a little bit of patchy fog. Uh, it looks like things have cleared up for the most part in the Golden Triangle. The exception, Columbus, still seeing some reduced visibilities, and that probably extending into West Alabama as well. So if you're traveling east of Highway 45 this morning, you might want to give yourself a couple extra minutes for the morning commute, but I'm not anticipating any widespread issues on the roadways this morning. Temperatures sitting in the low 40s across most of the area, 42 in Columbus, 41 in Amory. West Point coming in a little bit on the warm side at 47, uh, also sitting at 41 in Tupelo and in Corinth. Futurecast shows cloud cover today. We'll see a few breaks of sunshine, but Futurecast also showing these showers pushing through. It could start in our northwestern counties over towards places like Benton, Tippa County, Lafayette, Yellabusha counties as early as, say, 3 o'clock in the afternoon. But most spots, if you see a shower, it's going to be later on into the evening. This is for 7 p.m. I think Futurecast probably overdoing our rain chance a little bit here as well. More spots than not going to stay dry. Temperature is going to be topping out generally in the mid 60s in the Tupelo region. More upper 60s once you get into the Golden Triangle. West Alabama mid 60s north of I-22. More mid to upper 60s once you get south of I-22. We stay dry for Thursday. Same goes for Friday. But you notice that cold front back off to the north and west at the top of your screen. That pushes southeast through our area on Saturday. Now, the good news is the latest model runs indicate we're not going to have much instability in place, so we'll see a few showers and thunderstorms with that front. Nothing severe anticipated with it, so at least some good news there. So, rain chance today only at about 20%. Our better chance of rain coming with that front that pushes through on Saturday. Behind that front, another cold shot. High temperatures staying below the 60 degree mark Sunday and Monday, and Sunday and Monday nights, we may see those low temperatures drop below freezing. Guys.